Hi, this is Calibus doing an online commentary for Rome Total War. I command Scythia, my opponent uh, King Lunatech commands the Parthians. Uh, okay, let's see what my army consists of here. I got four minimum upgraded uh, Archer Warbands, and I have got four Gold Gold Chosen Archer Warband, and my uh, cavalry is six units of uh, head haunting maidens, which is gold gold. And I also have, uh, well, let's take a look at these head haunting maidens with their breastplates on. And I have Scythian Noble Horse Archers. Alright, my opponent with Parthia has two units of horse archers, one on his right wing and his left wing, and uh, they seem to be gold gold, or they could be gold with three stripes, I don't know. Uh, he's got a Eastern Infantry, some, I think, three or four units, whatever that, maybe five, with uh, units of slingers and archers mixed in, you can't really tell which is which in here and he's got five units of highly upgraded cataphracts back here with a general unit in it. I believe they're all gold gold but some of them might be gold with silver but very strong horse indeed but I'll put my head hunting maidens up that against them any day. Well alright I split my army in half to attack his horse archers, three headhunt maidens, uh, you know, two chosen archers, two uh, archer warband, and uh, my uh, noble uh, horse archers to rain the fire down on both flanks, try to lure out his uh, cataphracts so I could mow them down. As you can see, there's some arrow fire hitting them in the back. When they're not in Cantabrian Circle, or however you say that, um, they're kind of easy to pluck off. But he does get them back in the Cantabrian Circle and get less kills on them that way because they're constantly moving. So here my opponent, he rushes all his cataphracts to one side. And I have a micro lapse here. I should have rushed my other three head hunting maidens on my Roy flank over here. So I start rushing in my head hunting maidens from back here. Maybe he didn't see them. And while he's charging my archer warband, I start raining the fire, uh, missile fire on the flanks of his things. It does merely no damage. But the head hunting maidens get ar armor piercing bonus. And this is his micro missile uh, laps. He does not change to the mace, he's using the spears with his cataphracts. Huge mistake. I have three headhunting maidens against six cataphracts. And my headhunting maidens are mowing down some cataphracts. I held my uh, chosen archers in there so they couldn't run away. They says they're gold gold. Their attack's good. Just so the headhunting maidens can do their damage. And that's a mess round of that cavalry. See, back here, I don't know what I was doing. They're, they're chasing three headhunting maidens and chasing off a, a missile archer unit. They would have been much more useful here. If that guy had micro, if King Lunatic had good micro with his cataphract, he could have won that easily if he would have switched to the mace. Alright, well, I'm routing out the. Uh, the uh, horse archers are now ran the fire. Well, let's look at these guys. Look, they look like they're in pajamas. I mean, what, what's these guys wearing? Leopard stretch pants or some fishnet stockings? I don't know. These guys look like they're dressed in pajamas. Let's see what, what else these units look like. Huh? Look at these guys. Look at that. They got their pajamas and hats on. Purple pajamas, baby. They rock. Let's see. Any other unit? There's more purple pajamas there. Any other units? That's the Eastern Infantry. The same pajamas they're wearing. Jammy men. Pajammy instead of party. I believe the slingers, they got like a smoking robe on or something. I don't know. But look at these jammies. Look at that. Look at them. Just look. 
Are they frightening? I won't be straight. Look at these guys. They got their smoking jackets on. They got some white, you know, stretchy pants on underneath there. That with their little uh, white hat. Well, I'm going to rain the fire down on these jammy wearing, thigh high wearing guys. These slingers. Look at them. Die. Die. Your, your rocks are no match for an arrow. Blow that arrow. For, uh, uh, fishnet stockings all over the place. Look at that. Look at this. I mean, really? Who wants to be this on? Now look at that, look at my guys. Bare chested, tattooed, firing arrows, no shield. They'll take an arrow right in the chest. And look, they got like golf pants on or something. They're gonna play around the golf after this. With their goatees and long hair. <laughs> look, real men. Real men winning in war. Alright, now here he catches my uh my head on mains, I wasn't paying attention. They get routed, but we'll come back. Because the pajama men here, they got a, uh, you know, a good, uh, their bonus against cavalry. So, I have another micromanagement lapse here. I send in, I, I escape there while I charge with my head on mains. If I charge in here with my Scythian Noble horse arch, Try to like get a can of beer in a circle cook and he charges them. But watch this. So I hit all and I figure I'll sacrifice the unit. I figured they would have been rounded at this time. Look, they look like they got a Japanese samurai uniform on. How cool is that? But look at how long they're in there fighting. Six or however many units he's got. He's used to an infantry pajama guys. But alright, they finally round. Well after seeing that. And I believe they also come back. I figure I'm going to surround them. Dad, charge my head on the ladies because now I know that they're weak. I'm not scared, and I, if I lose all my mains, I'll just tear you up with my, uh, with my uh, archers. But here I'm isolating. Here comes another major charge. A flag. Boom. The jam of men flying. Look at this coming in the rear. Here it come. Boom! Look at that guy go fly. Oh, that's air time there. Air Jordan in his pajamas. It's a mass exodus of the pajama men. The pajama spearmen. Okay, now all's left is the uh, archer fight, but my opponent admits defeat. Who knows it's done. Uh, on another note, uh, I changed my name for this battle, One Eye of the Heathen. Uh, that's from the movie Valhalla Rising with Mads Mad Mickelson. And, uh, great movie. Great movie. I recommend you see it while you're looking at the statistics here. Um, the movie's Valhalla Rising again. And a uh, good game of my opponent. 